expect tough game. Yes, we have now some period when we should take uh, more points. Yes, it's tough. it will be tough season with uh, many games, and it will be great opportunity for us to take three points. How's the team feeling after the, the win on the road? Big win for you guys. Uh, good feelings, of course. We like to win the games, and uh, more we'll have one more opportunity. You can have to come, come in because of Nicolas Freire's injury. Uh, how do you feel physically, and has Nico trained this week? Uh, unfortunately, no. Yes, he got some injury. Yes, but for me, it's okay. It's I, I think it's worst part of football. Yeah, injuries. Um, how how how, is, how was uh, this week for you guys? For missing so many players because of the FIFA window, um, and how does that has changed? You know, maybe the approach tactically from what that has talked to you guys. Well, we have a lot of players. Yes, and we want to win. We want to play with this these guys and without guys we have good players also the back line is you know, yeah almost yeah, is yeah here yeah so um but i wanted to ask you about cj because he's obviously going to get an opportunity this week we spoke with him early on in the week um he hasn't had a lot of experience playing you know at any level really and especially in mls um how do you help him out you know the communication with the goalkeeper young goalkeeper yes he doesn't have this experience but i think it's time to get this experience, yeah, he's a great guy, great player, and I think uh, he'll be great. How important is, how important is the communication for you guys tomorrow, right? Because you have Jordy there, so I think you have a lot of experience if you, you know, look around for Mike, who else might be on the team tomorrow. So how important is, is that communication and that leadership going into tomorrow's game? Well, it's okay, and all some words, uh, Spanish words, yes, uh, all players can speak English, yes. It's so important to uh, have communication during the game, yes. But everybody speak. Which Spanish words do you know? Hombre. See, not so many now, but uh, I'm still working on that. Okay. Yeah. We saw a new defender gang here. I guess you guys met him, uh, Marcelo? Uh, not yet. Not yet. Okay. Yeah. Are you excited to get a new teammate to maybe get back to that back four, or how do you feel more comfortable in the back five? Uh, doesn't matter for me. Uh, it's training stuff. Maybe it's more question for training. Tra yeah, coach stuff. So you, the, the weather is good today. It's well, it's really rainy, but it's not as hot. Um, is, is that still something that you're trying to deal with, or you're you know 100% fine with the heat? No, I'm used to sun. Yeah, I like sun weather, yeah. but. In Ukraine, we call this football weather. Yeah, perfect weather. Good. One Thanks. quick one follow up because you've had to play with the three, the five, um, left, right, center mm -hmm. as a libero almost or as a marker. At this stage of your career, is that an easy adjustment? Was it ever hard to think, what am I doing now? No, it's, it's not difficult for me because I played uh, right. Right wing, or right back, center back, left center back. It's like for me, it's not so difficult. What do you thought about Luis's performances up top as of late, especially of course last week with the two goals? Have you thought about his form um, in the last few weeks? Uh, you saw like it's great player, and uh, he helped us too much uh, during our uh, last game, and uh, I hope he'll score tomorrow. Yeah, you're excited about that match in Monterrey. Finally, get to go and play out with one of the biggest teams in, in, in the continent. Yeah, I'm so excited. Yes, and I uh, it it will be the first time, mm -hmm. and I'll play in Mexico. Mm -hmm. Yes, we'll see. Thank Good. you. Thank you, guys. Thank you.